What's up, tennis athletes? It's Chris Heria. Today, I'm going to be taking you through a complete 20 minute full body cardio workout. We're going to shred up the body, burn fat and calories while simultaneously building muscle. If you're ready to get started, download the Thenix app in the App Store or Google Play Store. Open up to the YouTube workout section. You should be able to find this routine. You'll also find a warm up you can do that's before the routine. I'd advise to do that if you're not already warmed up. If you are, smash the like button and we're ready to get started. And anyone can jump in today's workout and get the benefits because it takes absolutely no equipment. And the exercises we'll be doing today are scalable and beginner friendly. What makes it difficult is the intensity at which you do them at. We're going to be going through 20 exercises, 45 seconds on with a 15 second break in between. We're going to do this high intensity interval training style to make our workout more efficient while increasing the time on retention in our muscles and burning more calories in a shorter amount of time, allowing us to get shredded while still building muscle. So the first exercise coming up is going to be burpees. We're actually going to be doing burpees every five minutes. And there's many ways to do burpees. For my beginners out there, you can do a burpee without a push up and without a jump as well. If that's too easy, try doing a burpee just with the push up without a jump. And for everyone else, just do normal burpees but if you do get fatigued, just go down in one of the easier progressions and continue on. So let's go for it. Pace yourself. Make sure you're regulating your breathing. That's how you're going to last. Last 10 seconds. Three, two, and one. Take 15 seconds to cool down. Next exercise, we're going to go for high knee taps. And for those of you doing the actual full length burpees, I know you can feel pretty winded right now. Take a second, catch your breath in through your nose, out through your mouth. You're gonna tap one knee, tap the other one. Go at your own pace. If you're feeling fatigued, you can go slow. Just bring one knee up at a time. But just keep going. Whatever you do, don't stop. More than halfway. Keep it up. Last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Whew. Let's go ahead and shake that off. Breathe in, breathe out. Next exercise coming up is gonna be mountain climbers. Let's get down on the ground. This is gonna shut up our abs and build muscle in our shoulders. We're gonna bring one knee up and then switch. If you're feeling fatigued, you can always go slow. Go at your own pace. Have a nice solid grip on the ground. And breathe, squeeze your core. We are almost there, hang in there. Reaching the end soon. Last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Whew. Go ahead and shake that off. Try to slow down your heart rate. The next exercise coming up is gonna be lunges. So we're gonna alternate. Put your hands on your head, feet shoulder width apart, big chest. Take a big step. Come back out. Squeeze your core. This is gonna be somewhat of an active rest for us because after this, we're gonna get into another bit of an intense exercise. So conserve your energy. Last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, last one. 
Poof. All right, try to catch your breath. Next, we're gonna get into bicycles. So let's get down on the ground to a laying position. This is gonna shred up our abdominals. And after this, you would have worked out your entire body and we will officially be one fourth done. So let's get your elbow and your knees to match up. Keep the pace. Squeeze the core. Remember, go at your own pace. If you're feeling fatigued, you can go ahead and slow down, but don't stop. We're not just building our bodies, we're building our mental endurance as well. Don't give up on yourself. Here we go, last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Whew. All right, we're officially one fourth done. We're gonna get right back into burpees. Every time we hit burpees, that's how you know we're into the next quarter. So this time I'm gonna do it without a jump. So let's get down on the ground, let's get right into it. Push up, stand up. For my beginners out there, or if you're feeling fatigued, you can go ahead and do it without the push up as well. Last 20 seconds. Work on your explosiveness. Exploding onto your feet. Last five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. There you have it. Next, we're gonna continue the burn with some jumping jacks, emphasizing on our shoulders, core, and our legs. Catch your breath. Let's get right into it. We are flying through this. Stay strong. It's all about regulating your breathing so that you don't gas yourself out. Perfect form. And of course, your mental strength. Your willingness to not give up. Almost there, here we go. Last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. There we go. That was a nice little warm up. We're gonna keep moving on with plank alternating toe taps. Let's get down to the ground into a plank position. Keep your core tight, you're gonna bring one foot up. Touch one side and touch the other side. This exercise, we're emphasizing our core, of course, as well as our shoulders, lower back, glutes. Keep it all tight, perfect form. Throughout this full workout routine, you should be focusing on how well you're doing every exercise. Don't worry about how many you're doing. Last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. <sighs> All right. That was definitely an ab killer. Love that move. Next exercise is gonna burn a lot of calories and build your legs. We're gonna be going for squats. Let's go ahead and catch your breath. <sighs> Hands on your head, big chest, feet shoulder width apart. Go down and up. Last 10 seconds. Just flew through this one. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, last one. 
there we have it. We're flying through this routine. Next up is flutter kicks. We're gonna be emphasizing on our core. And after this exercise, we're gonna officially be halfway done. So you wanna be in a seated position, fingers facing forward, abs tight, raise your legs, flutter them. Keep your core tight and keep up the intensity. Had these last two exercises bring down the intensity a bit because we're gonna bring it back up right after this to conserve that energy. Here we go, almost there. Last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Whew. Abs should be fired up by now. You know what's next. We're officially halfway through this routine, so that means we have burpees. And after those two exercises, I'm able to catch my breath, so I'm gonna go for jumping burpees again. You guys go for a progression that works for you. Remember, if you get fatigued halfway through the routine, you can always just go to an easier progression so that you don't stop. Even if you still get fatigued even more, just go to the easiest progression, but do not stop. Last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. There we have it. I am definitely feeling this. So I know those of you doing it at home are feeling it too and are on your way to getting shredded and developing real athleticism. So next up, we have butt kicks. Stay strong. I want you to tap your heels. So this is an exercise that we can maintain, but we still continue to burn calories while we try to regain our energy. But we still get some work in. Keep up the pace. Last 15 seconds. Work on building your willpower. Here we go, last five seconds. Five, four, Three, two, and one. We are flying through this routine. And I know I keep saying that, but we're actually more than halfway done. It feels like we only just started. Next up is gonna be in and outs. So let's go ahead and take it to the ground. Push up position. I want you to go at your own pace. You don't have to go super fast or even do any big jumps. You can do small little jumps, go at a light pace, or you can do bigger jumps. As I said before, at the beginning of the video, what determines the difficulty is the intensity at what you do each exercise. So that's up to you. Almost there. Here we go. Last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, Two and one. Let's go. All right, I'm breaking a sweat and my whole body has a crazy pump. Next up, we're gonna get into alternating side lunges. Let's get right into it. Feet shoulder width apart, big chest, hands on your head. One side, other side. More than halfway there. Here we go. Last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, 
and one. There we have it. We have one last exercise. Then we're gonna go into the fourth quarter of this routine. So let's get down on the ground for our next exercise, Russian twists. From a seated position, we're gonna lift our legs up, touch one side and touch the other side. Keep your core tight and keep your feet as straight as you can. For my beginners out there, you can always bend your legs. This is gonna make it easier. Keep that core tight. Remember, if you start to feel fatigued, you can always bend your legs in the middle of the routine. Last 10 seconds, here we go. Five, four, three, two, and one. Whew. All right, we're getting back into burpees. So you know what that means. These are the last five exercises that we're gonna be doing to finish off this routine. Give it everything you got. Go for the burpees. You don't have to do it with a jump. Let's go. Stand up. Work on your explosiveness. Last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, last one. All right, four more exercises to go. Next up is side hops. We're gonna keep our heart rate up with this one. Continue to burn calories, build our legs. So we're gonna open up our leg to the right, touch the ground, hop over to the other side and alternate. Keep your core tight, squat down. Want to replace the position with the other foot. Here we go. Almost through. Squeeze your core. Down the last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right. Almost done. Next up is gonna be plank side to side. So catch your breath and then bring it down to the ground into a plank position. From this plank position, we're gonna tap one side, get down on the other side. Squeeze your core, keep your feet together and keep moving. More than halfway there. Stay strong. Should have worked those abdominals. Last five seconds. Three, two, and one. All right. We just have two more exercises to go. Coming up next is gonna be alternating curtsy lunges. Feet shoulder width apart, hands up, big chest. We're gonna get to one side, lunge, and then get onto the other side. So you wanna put your foot behind you and lunge. Foot behind. Remember, you don't have to worry about how many you're doing. Just focus on how well you're doing them. Last 10 seconds, here we go. Five, four, three, two, 
Last one. We are down to the last and final exercise. Let's hit the ground. We're gonna be going for seated in and outs. Whatever you do, do not give up on this last one. Here we go. Knees in, knees all the way out. Remember, you can go at your own intensity. You can go fast or you can go nice and slow. This is the last one. So really you want to give it everything you got. You don't want to leave any energy left behind after this. Give it everything you got on this last one. Keep up the intensity, we're almost there. Last 10 seconds. Here we go. Everything you got, five, four, three, two, and one there we have it sheesh i have a crazy pump as you can see i am drenched in sweat and we just flew through a 20 minute routine that would usually take a lot longer if you didn't do it this efficiently so congratulations for everybody that got through this with me you are 100 percent on your way to getting shredded and building a solid physique definitely make sure to come back to this routine at least once a week and for the best results i'd recommend to do it at least three times a week i do cardio personally pretty much every single day and usually when i do cardio i do it for at least 40 minutes so doing this routine two times in a row is also very beneficial but anyway thank you so much for working out with me if you enjoyed the routine please smash that like button we really appreciate it and it helps youtube share our videos to more people out there to show our appreciation if you comment down below within 30 minutes of any upload you're always going to have a chance to win some thenx gear so make sure you hit the subscribe button with bell notifications on right now so that you never miss a video we post every single sunday 8 p.m usa eastern time and don't forget to get this workout routine on your phone and schedule it at any time wherever you're at download the thenx app in the app store or google play store get full access to all our workout programs technique guides teaching the most advanced movements like the full planche human flag muscle up hand stand push up and so much more step by step as well as daily workouts that are meant to challenge you and break your plateaus sent straight to your phone and join the thenx community of millions of thenx athletes around the world getting in the best shape of their lives right now also for more of my content during the week make sure you're following my vlog channel we do some fun stuff over there that's youtube.com slash chris harrier you can also follow me on instagram and tiktok as well on every platform we're always doing some type of giveaway so if you want a chance to be a part of that make sure you're following liking and commenting that's going to wrap it up for today's video and guys i'm always trying to deliver the best videos for you all so if you have any ideas something i haven't done before or something that you'd like me to cover more on leave it in the comment section down below if it gets enough likes and comments we're definitely going to be doing it we'll even shout you out for the video idea until next time i'll see you next sunday 8 p.m usc eastern time mad love and peace out